Hello, I'm Scott Wyatt, President of Southern Utah University. Thanks for taking the time to explore majors with us. We want you to discover your passion and talent, so we created this series for you. Choosing a major may be overwhelming to some of you. These short interviews with professors began the process. What major are we spotlighting today, Ellen? Today we have a spotlight on engineering with Dr. Matt Roberts. So Matt, tell us what you love about this field and how you got involved with it. As I've been studying engineering, as I've been teaching it, one of the things that I really like about engineering is just how much of an impact engineers have made on humanity and, and improving you know, our way of life. If you look back you know, through the 20th century, life expectancy almost doubled. Um, and, we, and most of us attribute that to medical knowledge and medicines mm -hmm. and things like that. Mm -hmm. But you can, you know, probably about half of that um, increase in life expectancy occurred because of clean water. And that's something, you know, that engineers have been, have been intimately responsible for in, in, in as far as cleaning our water and making sure we have that clean water. So, so what kind of student is attracted to this field? Like who would be really great at engineering? You do need to have competency in math and science. But, um, you know, it's interesting when I talk to employers who hire engineers, I've, I've asked them and I've said, what is it that you look for when you're hiring an engineer? You know, and, and you would think they'd say, well, we want them to be, you know, great problem solvers, have all these great technical skills. But what they tell me is that, yes, they do have to have technical skills, but if you graduate with a degree in engineering, we know you've got that. Um, if you graduate from an accredited program, you've got those technical skills. What they're looking for when they're hiring people is do you have communication skills? Can you work well in a team? Do you have leadership skills? And so it's, it's those professional skills that are also very important in engineering, being able to communicate, being able to lead, being able to work as a team that are critical for engineering. So who would really hate engineering? Who wouldn't do well in engineering at all? That's a good question. I, as I mentioned before, you know, engineers are problem solvers mm -hmm. and the tools we use are math and science to do that. And, and so if you just don't like math or science, um, it's probably gonna be difficult to do. Um, the other thing that's really good about our program here is it's very hands-on. So I'll be honest with you, the schools I went to, um, we did a lot of, a lot of the engineering we did was paper, on paper, doing reports and things like that. Um, but here, it's much more hands-on. The students are building things, they're testing things. And I think that experience, and they do, you know, they do obviously do the analytical stuff, the, the, the paper-based design, but that hands-on experience is really important. Okay, is there anything else that you think that we should know about studying engineering? One of the most important things I would say is that you have to be prepared if you're gonna study, for if you're gonna study engineering, you have to be prepared to work hard. Um, you know, like anything in Good. life, you know, if it's worth doing, typically it's, it's difficult to do. And so, you know, it's a little bit of an issue. We have our engineering students, they've got roommates in other majors who aren't doing as, you know, they're not spending as much time on their studies necessarily, um, whereas the engineering students, you know, it's a lot of time. So I think, you know, if you want to go into engineering, you, gotta, you have to make that commitment up, up front that this is something that I think I want to do that looks like it'll be enjoyable and I'm willing to, do, to put in the time to do it. That's great. Thank you so much for being with us sure. today. You're welcome. Thank you. This was Spotlight on Engineering with Dr. Matt Roberts.